Lopez, big on on the med side as well. Last night, Oakland University beat the University of Kentucky. It was a huge upset, and one of the Oakland players is a familiar name here in mid-Michigan. That's right. Rachel Ramsey spoke with him and some of his biggest supporters, and she's here for you now with how they're all feeling after that historic win. Yeah, Sherry Siobhan, number 11, Blake Lampman, is in his last year at Oakland, which is in Rochester, Michigan. He's a guard for the team, but his journey started with him playing around here as a Hazlitt Viking. We're looking forward to another, another game. We get to play another game with each other, so it's pretty cool. The Oakland University basketball team is headed to the second round of March Madness. The Golden Grizzlies pulled out a win against the Kentucky Wildcats last night, and Blake Lampman was right in the middle of it all. Pretty much everybody I know has reached out and... Um, it's been a cool little 12 hours. I spoke with Blake, who says he's been feeling the love from his hometown of Hazlitt. His high school coach, Chris Smith, told me he's the hardest working player to come through the program. Blake was a kid that showed up the first day of basketball camp, and he stayed all day for all the different sessions, for all the different age groups. And when he came back the second day, I, I you know, you don't, you don't have to be here all day long. He said, oh, no, coach, I want to be here. I want to help whenever I can. His parents, Lori and Steve Lampman, are enjoying the ride as well. They've been there every step of the way. It's amazing to see that he's gotten from uh, Hazlitt High School to where he's at now. It's not just been a cakewalk. Uh, it's work, and he's had injuries. He's overcome a lot of obstacles in that area, and uh, he's enjoying the fruit of that right now. He's worked really hard. People don't even have a clue how hard he works. But to see it all come to fruition for him and his team is just amazing. Number 11 looked back at last night's game. He says he's a very happy Golden Grizzly right now. It's something you kind of dream about as a kid. Dream extremely big, extremely big. If, if people aren't if if people aren't laughing at your, your dreams and your goals, you're not you're not dreaming big enough. The last time Oakland was in March Madness was 2011. Next, they'll take on NC State tomorrow at the PPG Paints Arena. Lampman says they'll take this one game at a time. Back to you.